This video will show you how to work with class templates. In Visual Paradigm for UML, begin with a new class diagram. Let's create a template class and name it FArray. Press Enter. We'll add two formal template parameters. Right click on it, select Add and then template parameter. The first one is an con unconstrained class template parameter and we'll name it T and then click OK. Let's add the second one. Right click on it again, select add template parameter and we'll name this one K and this is of integer expression type and over here we're going to set the default value to 10 then click OK now let's create a bound class and we'll name it address list press enter and we're going to add a binding dependency here and select binding dependency and then click on the address list and then drag it to the F array. Now right click on this line here and select open specification. Under the general tab in the template info field we're going to type in the substitution. So now T becomes address and k becomes 3. Click OK. Now to show the binding right click on the diagram and select presentations options and select show template info and then you will see the substitution here. Next, we'll show you how to create an anonymous bound class. Drag the F array class onto the diagram and then create a new class. Add a binding dependency and click on the new class and drag it to the F array. Now, right click on the line here, select open specification. And then for a template info, we're going to type in the substitution. And this time t becomes point. And to make this an anonymous bound class, make sure you check the checkbox at the bottom here. Then click OK. Now you see the substitution displayed in this class. Let's say you rename this class to F array 2 and then press enter and that update will be reflected in the new class as well. Now um, let's say that you don't need to show this template class on the diagram. You can select it and then right click on it, select delete. Now in this dialog box just click no to delete the shape from this diagram only but have it stayed in the repository.